This is way too runway. Here we're adopting the runway trends and making them our own. Have you ever felt lost when looking at the fashion trends? There could be so many reasons for that. Maybe you saw something cool, but you don't know how to fit it into your existing wardrobe and your lifestyle, or maybe you are not sure how that would work for your body because in the runway you see tall skinny models. Oh my God, you are my model, okay. Tall skinny models. <laughs> Trust me, I feel you there. I'm just 5'4" and I always have to adjust everything to my body type, to my height, so I feel it there. But on the bright side, I went through this experience by myself before I became fashion stylist and started making a living out of it. So in this video, I will show you how to adapt the trends from the upcoming season, spring, summer 2021, to your personal wardrobe using my own. Hit the like button if you're excited about this video and let's have fun and show the runway who's the boss here. Did I actually say that? Oh my god, I'm so excited and let's dive in right into this whole ocean of spring summer trends. One of the biggest trends for this season is anything baggy or volumed up. You can call it however you want. Let's take a look at some references first. And probably when you're looking at layover ones, you're wondering like, how am I gonna wear it in my day-to-day -day life? Like, this is way too runway. <laughs> I feel you, I understand. I wouldn't wear it to daily life either, even though like being a fashion stylist and being around fashionable people, being on the set, this is not everyday clothing. But at the same time, let's take a look at Stella McCartney's suit, which I think is a great source of inspiration for our goal. How to look chic, trendy, and stylish every day following the trends. What am I gonna do is take inspiration from Stella McCartney and take my own personal style and mix them together. That's the system you will need to use in adapting trends your way to your personal wardrobe. How can I describe my personal style in hashtags? I would say hashtag crystals, hashtag monochromatic, hashtag total black, hashtag turtleneck lover, I don't know. But those are the main things uh, that I'm obsessed about. Let me know down in comments what are the keywords that are representing your personal style. If you're not sure, check out my other video, I will leave it right here about how to find your personal style that would be very helpful for you because once you know what works for you what is the dna of your style that would be so easy for you to put together the looks and by the way what i would also add this is my signature style the sunglasses the prada ones i got them like how many years ago in Paris they were adjusted to my face. This is also my accessory that I would add with any look, like it doesn't matter what I wear. If you have something similar, like the shoes that you use or the bag that you wear all the time or sunglasses, make sure to use it, do not forget it. Number one option, how to like recreate the baggy look is using uh, wide leg pants. I found these ones, which remind me a lot the Stella McCartney look and even the color. So I'm gonna try on these pants with the turtleneck. Like I said, I love monochromatic and I love turtleneck. So this is the way of me creating the look adjusted to my personal style. The second option with the baggy pants would be grabbing a pair of a very like classy look pants, the black ones. How am I gonna wear these pants? Well, first of all, I can style them with the sweater. And like I said, I'm all about crystals and this sweater has a lot of them. I also want to add something bright to it. I'm gonna style this look with these shoes. They have crystals here. Also, I feel like without breaking the black in this case with something bright, that would look like it's styled too much. I would style the same pants with a baggy sweater. This is, I would call it like maximum volume. Like imagine in the car when you know like driving or like listen to music, you increase volume and to the maximum level. That would be the maximum level because the pants are baggy and wide leg and this sweater has volume too. Another idea could be styling this 
culottes which became very big trend and we love it so much we wear it that could be other version of the baggy pants and they could be easily styled again with the turtleneck like this if i would want to make it very chic and very special i would definitely style these culottes with these boots and as you can see they are very tall very cool if you want something more than just the pants you can try the jumpsuit which could be also a way of representing the baggy trend in your look try to like style with either of one of those turtlenecks so it's all in the same color palette or personally i would just wear it as it is without anything underneath and i would just throw in the jacket the blazer and let's move on to blazers honestly if you have brother boyfriend husband to dad just go to their closet and grab the blazer that would be the best of the best that's a little tip for you so using baggy jacket in your look could be other way of recreating this trend for your everyday wear and how am i gonna adapt this one to my personal wardrobe i will style it with the shorts If you're enjoying this video and you're loving all those spring summer trends and you want to have them available anytime you just need to look at the references, you can download my personal uh, fashion trends report for free from my website. I will leave you a link down below and I also added instructions there on how to adapt the fashion trends to your own wardrobes make sure to check the link down below the next trend that i really want to bring your attention to is three-piece suit and right now you see some references on your screen what's important here if you remember like a couple seasons ago in the last season it was all about suits but this season something new comes in and that's this little guy the best the symbol west changes everything that would be great if you like suits and you wear suits all the time just to get a three-piece suit and if you don't if uh, suits is not something that's relevant for your personal lifestyle or your personal style give a try to this little guy and style this one with the black baggy pants that would be so chic so stylish and as you see uh all trends you can mix and match them speaking of three-piece suit we have these pants we have this little guy and we have the blazer so there you go the three-piece suit is right here how i would make it personal how i would adapt this look to my personal style i will add this mesh gloves to the look shoes and accessories are your best friends they help you to own what you wear let's talk about oh my god this is my favorite trend of the season i'm so excited because this is my favorite color this is sky blue suit and right now you see some references from the runway but here we're adopting the runway trends and making them our own so let me show you what i got that's my version of a sky blue suit first of all I also love silk. I forgot to mention that, but like silk and satin fabrics because I think they look very chic, expensive, and for day to day outfits, they add something special. I found this great suit on Asus sky blue uh, satin jacket blazer, oversized again, that suit style blazer and comes with a high waisted shorts another my love high waisted shorts. And what's important here, I want to point it out that there is no like buttons that's very important to keep your look expensive so i'm going to style it with this top to keep the look monochromatic or i could style it with the bustier top and the good thing about it is that it's also like satin feel it's not satin not silk but it has this delicate shine and i feel like this is my easter outfit <laughs> check my stories on Instagram around Easter time you will see me running in this outfit and looking for those eggs moving on to the next trend and actually I'm wearing it right now it's wide leg or straight leg jeans when I was doing trend research which I do uh, every season as stylist I was 
fascinated by the amount of the designers who use this trend in their collections. Just look at it, Balenciaga, Gucci, Valentino, uh, Victoria Beckham, how you can style those jeans. So idea number one is right here, you can style them with some very neutral color, like this color complements my hair color. That's why I love it, that's why I wear it. So keeping this look pretty neutral. But other way could be styling this white leg jeans with a simple, white button down short and this one is for men's department again i think men has the best button down shorts this one is from h&m easy iron this is my go-to short it's also part of my styling kit great to have especially when you don't know what to wear just wear the jeans wear the short last trend for uh this video by the way the part two will be coming next week so make sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell button so you will be notified right away once the second part is on the channel so this trend has stayed in our wardrobe on the streets on the runway everywhere for a while but i want to give you the idea of how you can use this trend differently by the way i'm talking about place so idea number one is actually inspired by the Gucci look, which is about this a little lace bodysuit. If you can see the texture right here, I'm going to style it with, again, those baggy pants, the black ones, and possibly throwing on top of it this blazer. Or instead of pants, I will style it with the shorts and again with the blazer another idea would be wearing the lace blouse this one has some interesting detail here i say just wear it with something very simple either pants or the black shorts and this would definitely elevate your look but what's gonna be special about this is styling it with the lace shoes as you can see these shoes have lace so styling this and again it's total black look but What's important in total black look and any monochromatic look is playing with the textures. Check out my other video about how to look expensive. I will leave it right here. Another idea, go for the total lace dress. It has different textures, like it has lace here and kind of mesh here and lace again, like lace layering. This is, I feel like a new take on something that we have been wearing for a long time, those slit dresses with lace and paired with the flats or heels, whatever you want, in the same colors. As you see, like I have the nude ones that matching this lace perfectly. That's my way of keeping the look monochromatic, consistent, and like in this case, the same texture. Okay guys, today we talked about the first five trends of the season. The next part, part two, will be released next week. The spring would be here before we know it, and I'm personally so excited to go outside and wear something cool, something nice, something trendy. I definitely feel like we had enough time of the sweatpants, and let's make the spring-summer season very bright, very fun, very playful. And don't forget, you are the trans boss.